Welcome to EVE Online, I'm Major Freak. Uh, talk a bit about um, uh, strategic um, ideas about your Athenor. It's in high sec. Uh, you've outfitted it. You haven't got the skills trained yet. Um, you've got the ammo loaded and you got the fighters loaded. Nice selection. Um, You've got backups, you've got rig spot, um, and you've got fireworks launcher, <laughs> and stand-up signal uh, if you need to switch out for quicker locking. Um, so you're like, okay, um, do I need all this? Do I need to have all these fighters loaded? Um, ship scanning and cargo scanning won't see what fighters you have loaded so it's not like that's going to be um, an intimidation factor in fact you can launch stuff it will be but do I really need now that I know which fighters which fighter complements I should have um, in any situation and what I'd like to have I'm thinking well uh, do I really need half a billion and more in my ammo and fighter base seriously why the heck do I need that much um, I've got about 12,500 12, is um, 75 days worth if you've got uh, Columbia uh, that's that's good you don't need any more if you've got any more keep it in uh, um, items bay. Uh, if your Athenor gets taken out, anything in corporate hangars better be taken out before then because it'll be dumped in a loot box. So, yeah, be aware of that. But they are handy. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to move all my ammo and fighters into my handy dandy ammo named and drone hanger so therefore I've got you know it's it's uh, where the heck did I put them ah. so I've got you know just over half a billion in my uh, ammo and let's move this stuff as well over here there we go. Okay, so that's over a billion, especially with the rigs right here. The same price as the other stuff. Keep it for a rainy day. When you need it, you've got it. And if you don't, don't put it in your Athena. I mean, Astro House. You can put stuff in. You can't stake, take stuff out. Um, this is a brick shit house, high sec fit. It's very good at what it does, and it's not overly blingy. These are the least expensive upgrades you can get, uh, and they come in at your CPU level, and it's highly recommended. Uh, you go for DPS over anything else. Uh, lots of ECM, but they are cap hungry. You're going to have nine minutes. Um, at uh, an unrigged uh, level. Uh, if you add the rigs, they can spiral up in duration to quite, uh, let's see, um, this is the, the heaviest is, the heaviest use is um, ECM. And this rig, very expensive, but so absolutely worth it. You almost double your uh, duration. The uh, neutralizer efficiency also is very good, up to 22 minutes almost. This is for range, your base range on your ECM, which people count on as only 75 clicks, can be extended. Two hundred and nine. That's pretty impressive. Uh, the neutralizer is 100 clicks. This is 109. Now, anything beyond that, it's going to be up to your fighters. 
and this is zero skills and if I load up my ammo for crews against you know the heavy ships you're gonna be facing that's uh, almost 3,000 DPS uh, that's uh, sustained with zero skills I highly recommend you train up your now in you can only use in corp um, owner corp uh, characters to man your guns in high sec against war targets yeah I've tried you can't do neutral characters unfortunately so that's that um, these don't really add a lot of time but you have all these skills up you can spiral up to an hour if you turn these off you can get up to an hour if you turn the neutralizers off and play havoc with the ECM you can stretch it for an hour or you can get about I think 40 minutes or so around approximately I've got the stats in another video um, so yeah it's uh, well worth the time and these aren't faction or anything and they're not blingy and they don't have crazy number of you know th th no tech 2 rigs and stuff and these are the tech 2's are worth it for these two and yeah it's not blingy fit and highly recommend it um, yeah and I'll definitely be not rigging it uh, until I need to because why would you need to rig your ship your, your, your ship unless you're going to be war decked and you know your uh, Astro is going to be targeted so yeah that is an idea uh, I'd highly recommend it and it gives you options say if you want an, an anchor and move it somewhere else you have that option and you, you won't destroy your rigs so recommend that totally okay so uh that's my suggestions uh that i'll be instituting